Yamaha RD350F for sale on eBay. Possibly the F2, I'm not absolutely sure, it could be an F1, but I think it's more likely to be an F2, I'd guess. Uh, the paperwork with the bike, it comes with a um, HPI check certificate that shows the bike is all completely clear. No accidents in its history or finance or anything in its background to be concerned about. It comes with its V5 registration document. Um, that shows that it was first registered in 1987. It's a UK bike by the looks of it. It's got some sort of service bills and things with it. Not much of a service bill, though, but little bits and pieces like that. Um, it's got its old MOT test certificates. The last one expired in 2002, which possibly was the last time it was used. Uh, a couple of things to show you around the bike. Uh, one is that um, when I started the bike up, which hadn't been run for a long time, um, it started relatively easy. Um, but it kind of um, leaked a bit of um, what looked like oil underneath. But... Not a lot, a bit, but it wasn't leaking before I tried to start it, so I put fuel in it. So what can often happen with a two-stroke is that the fuel leaks down the exhaust and then dissolves some of the um, the oil in the exhaust system. And that looks like oil dribbles out the bottom. There might have been a bit of that. I doubt whether it was the oil from the oil tank or from the engine, uh, from the transmission, because it hadn't leaked before. So that might have to be dealt with. Uh, maybe if it's fuel in the exhaust, you've just got to use it to sort of burn it off. But anyway, there's that. The bike looks like it's been fitted with a new rear shock absorber. Um, doesn't look like a second arm, it looks like actually a new one. So, uh, And the rear suspension links seem relatively um, good order. There's a tiny bit of up and down play on the uh, on the link there, but very small. I was an MOT inspector for 15 years and I wouldn't, I wouldn't normally fail that. I don't think I'd even do an advisory on that. But there's that. Um, the, the bike is generally a bit rough here and there. There is actually it's not that easy to see but there's a dent in the tank there. Um, the bike is complete, it's still got its indicators on there, it does run. Um, so ideally it wants putting back into action really. So there we go. Uh, I've not seen anything else around it. I mean it's it's a little scruffy but it wants it wants um, somebody to get hold of it and do something with it. So there we go. Good luck with the bidding.